glory to god my dear brothers and sisters i have an amazing word for you a word to help you a word to encourage you remember every single day i encourage you i release these powerful words my brothers and sisters the word is they left you and it backfired there are people who said that they have nothing to do with you there are people who were so close to you there are people who were with you but they left you they conspired against actually these people some of them are the reason as to why you are struggling right now some of you it is a heartbreak you experienced this you went through this and it has been hard for you to deal with this case to deal with this situation to get over it some of you got into relationships with people who promised you a lot who promised to be with you but all of a sudden they decided to leave you some of you actually you are going through this where someone wants to divorce you some of it may not be a relationship so to say it may be someone who was like a friend someone who stood by you but now they are the ones who are accusing you they are the ones that have betrayed you but now it has backfired some of them wish to come back but there is no time for them there is no room for them they cannot come back they cannot confess they cannot my brothers and sisters whatever your enemies have done it is not going to work some of you your enemies uses your closest friends to betray you that is right your enemy can even use your family to speak evil against you actually your enemy can even use people who are like your children grandchildren to fight against you some of you the battles that you are going through are family battles family battles and we have seen it throughout our history a lot of battles are family battles look at joseph who do you think fought against him do you think it was someone away from him no it was his own family joseph had a dream that the stars were bowing down to him he told the dream to his brothers but his brothers thought it other way they fought against him can you imagine that his brothers did not have a revelation of course they had the ability to interpret dreams they had attended dream interpretation classes and they could interpret dreams but they did not know who they were do you know that joseph's brothers were stars because joseph had a dream that stars were bowing down to him and those stars were the representation of his brothers his family but they lacked revelation so they fought against the dreamer and they ended up so, so selling him to a foreign land brothers and sisters the one who betrayed jesus was judas iscariot judas from the tribe of judah and jesus is referred to as the lion of the tribe of judah judas was like a family member to jesus of course because they were from the same country the same area they lived in the same uh, household jesus was the master judas was the follower jesus the king of kings judas the disciple but he, he lacked revelation that he betrayed the son and the king of kings your betrayers what they lack is revelation your enemy what he lacks is revelation the ones that killed jesus had they known what would become of jesus they wouldn't have crucified him the enemy lacks revelation because when jesus died we benefited we were beneficiary you and i were beneficiaries of jesus's death he died that we can live scripture says it clear that for god so loved the world 
that he gave his only begotten son that whoever should believe in him should not perish but have everlasting life if you believe in jesus you are not going to perish but you are going to have everlasting life my brothers and sisters those that left you they now regret because they need you they were benefiting from you you are a blessing to them i love what uh, laban said to joseph because joseph reached at a time whereby he wanted to to leave and laban said this to joseph that please don't go if i have found favor in your sight for i have learned by experience that the Lord has blessed me because of you. Laban learned by experience because God had blessed him because of Joseph. I mean, I mean because of uh, Jacob, that is right. Because of Jacob. Jacob was a blessing to Laban. Some of you, you are a blessing. You are a blessing to them. The moment they let go of you, they realize that their businesses will not work. Their life will not be the same again. You added value to them. You are treasure. That's why you see the scripture says, um, we have this treasure in earthen vessels. There is treasure in you that is far much precious than gold and silver. That is why Jesus died for you. Jesus did not die, did not die for other, other creations. He died for you for you and I because he knows how precious we are how precious we are to him brothers and sisters it is the end of this word hope it has blessed you I hope it has encouraged you until next time God keep you safe remember to leave your comments in the comment section and also share this gospel with someone until next time Shalom